Hi, it's Billy here doing a packaging of um, some of the SD Gundams I got today. It's a collection of Gundam from Gundam Wing and also Gundam X as well as Turning Gundam. As you can see on this side here, we've got our work cut out for us, so let's get to it. Let's start here with the Wing Gundam, obviously, for a lot of these kids I bought just from a guy that was selling them in an auction, and uh, he was uh, basically selling all of his collection as a set. I'm not sure how well you can make out these kids, but this is the resolution of my camera here. And uh, next is the Gundam Death Knight. Now this one I did buy it separately. It didn't come with the whole collection, but uh, it was a little bit more expensive than I expected. But I was needed to complete my collection. So as you can see, the runners, some inserts, and there's the manual. Yeah, looks like we got three plates there. So this one. Nice yellow part for the leaf in. And uh, it goes in the order. Here's the kind of heavy arms. This one's still in its package, which is nice. Some of these are, uh, I guess they're not in their plastic wraps anymore, but I hope all the parts are still there. Looks like heavy arms here. Uh, again, it's one tiny piece of polycap here, and yellow leaf in, otherwise it's two colors. And um, Gundam Zero Four here, Sandrock, which I've shown previously. And uh, this one it looks like, oh, this one is still in its package too, so I'll, I'll decide which one I'll, I'll build. And here's the Shenlong Gundam. Uh, here's shows all the accessories and gimmicks. Uh, uh, it's a different texture of bag and looks like this completely blue and uh, giant sticker sheet. One tiny piece of piece of polycap there. Shenlong Gundam. Looks like it's very gonna be very simple. With Easy broker. And uh, here's the Steve Wing Zero, which I've shown before and uh, I have built already, which I'm going to talk about this later. Here's the Wing Zero that I've built already from a previous kit, which I'll reveal later. And uh let's see this one is still everything is intact. And uh Epion. This is both one of the reasons I got this set for. I mean this is just really hard to come by right now. And um this I'll have this to go with my master grade, you can tell. Plates are have already been opened, but hopefully I have all the parts here. It looks like I have all the parts in this kit, so I'm not too worried. Here's the heat rod. Gonna come in a couple of parts, I guess. Yeah, I'm looking forward to see how that turns out. Happy on. I don't run over the sticker sheet. Don't run over the time limit too much. And we have the Epion, and of course, we need the Toggies. Toggies. Oops, one zero. There we go. Uh, looks 
like our standard three runners, sticker sheets, manual here. Toggles. For the Geminis 01, there's two of them that are just included here. I'm not exactly quite sure what this kit is all about, but I guess I'll find out more about it. Like, I hope all the parts are here, and what else to say? Looks like there's something else here in the box. Let's find out. Hmm. Okay. And, uh, menu. I really like that uh, being sword there, so... Oh, it's just identical. And on to the Gunnam X collections. Called the Gunnam X. Again, this is one of the more rare kits that you can't really buy anywhere right now, so... It's one of the reasons I got this kit for. And you can see, it looks like all the parts are still intact. It's gonna mix. Yeah. Exciting. Longer than I thought. This one it looks like it's just the loose runners and your standard three runners. Yeah. Sticker sheet. And it looks like it's still intact. My arms are getting really sore from this. Airmaster. Run out plate, and uh, looks like the good thing about this one is I think it transforms. And there's all the Gunna Max kits, and um, last but not least, the Turning Gundam. This one is just like lots of plates, lots of parts. Looks like one of the unique things is it has this metal chain thing. It gets for that to hyper hammer. Again, very nice clear pink effect parts for the beam saber. Um, there. This is one of definitely one of the better G Generation F kits. Now so you think there's a couple of them missing, and that uh, or towards the Gundam Double X and the Wing Zero Custom. Well, there they are. These are the ones I got from a long time ago, and they have already been built and painted. And let's see if I don't screw up too much. Here's the Gundam Double X, which I'm gonna put to the side there. And uh, the Wing Zero Custom. This is actually my very first Gundam there. So, I mean, it's a pretty nice collection. And uh, honestly, it, how many of them we have made into Master Grade? We got the Turney Gundam. And, um,. Uh, We have Gunnam Wing, so that makes two of them. And we have the Epion, that only out of the entire set, only three of them have seen Master Grade. I mean, it's not even Epion, so. Like, thanks for watching. I'm really looking forward to build these. And there's a few more Gundams I've got to review. And